So when you're in the plan and assess phase, Red Hat has quite a lot of capabilities that can help you through this process. There's a few important things that you should keep in mind as you start implementing a cloud. Uh, a lot of enterprises are very interested in the cloud because they think it's going to give them a lot of efficiencies, it's going to drive down their costs and so on. Some of the big concerns uh, deal with, you know, how do I take advantage of my existing infrastructure and grow it incrementally uh, towards the cloud? Uh, there's a few different approaches uh, that you can take. You can either build a brand new cloud that's totally separate from everything that you're doing, or you can take a cloud and incrementally layer it on top of uh, your existing infrastructure. Uh, and those are two you know, really radically different approaches. Uh, if you wanted to do sort of the cloud in a box approach where I just buy it and I lay down a new stack, um, it makes it easy to deploy your cloud, but it makes it really, really difficult to transition everything that you've already got into the cloud. And so uh, that's one aspect. On the other hand, if you want to be able to deploy on top of your existing infrastructure, you've got to be able to select a cloud architecture that's that's extremely open, that can deal with a wide heterogeneous mix of infrastructure and technologies and so on. Otherwise, your cloud is not going to encompass everything that you need to do. So one of the unique benefits of working with Red Hat around cloud is we have a very open architecture. So because we support standards and open source APIs like Delta Cloud, we can help you build your cloud architecture on top of everything that is already in place. So your choice of physical systems, your choice of virtualization technology, your choice of public cloud providers as you move towards the hybrid cloud. So that means that you can take our cloud portfolio with cloud forms and so on and layer that on top of your existing architecture without having to throw that away and you can incrementally use that as you get the benefits of cloud through automation and abstraction. <laughs>